Feed the bear and he will score. And now it looks like French club Auxerre are willing to feed Mullerwell a fee of over £1 million in order to get the transfer of Theo Bear. Welcome back, guys, to Fog Football. And it looks like Mullerwell's number one man up front, Theo Bear, could be leaving Scottish football. He could be on his way to Ligue 1 after Auxerre has come in with a bid of over £1.2 million for the Canadians. So what a sign in Theo Bear has been for Mullerwell. We first seen him in Scotland with St Johnston. He didn't play very well and I think that's been generous. He could not hit a barn door and he was pretty much considered a dud. He scored one goal in 34 league appearances for St Johnston and his contract was terminated in July. Mullerwell seen this, they decided to take a chance on Theo Bear. Not sure why, when Mullerwell first signed them, people were wondering, like, why are they doing this? We know that Kevin Fanfine had just left. People knew Mullerwell needed a replacement, but they didn't see Theo Bear replacing the goals that Fanfine was going to leave behind. And, I mean, he did that. He was great. Mullerwell signed him on a two-year deal. Last season, he was phenomenal. He played in all Mullerwell's 38 league games, scoring 15 goals, which is a great return for a club like Mullerwell. Uh, he got a call-up for the Canadian squad as well. So, so he's had success at not just club level, but also on the international stage. His Canadian team were unlucky in the Copa America, making it to the semi-finals before getting knocked out against Uruguay. Mullerwell boss Stuart Kettlewell said this season he was going to give Bear an extended break before returning to the club and he wanted to keep Bear for the future. However, it looks like now Bear will not be returning at all as French club Auxerre, who were promoted to Lagoon after becoming champions last season in the second tier, there has been interest from a lot of clubs in signing Field Bear, but it looks like Auxerre are the ones that are going to get the deal over the line. They did offer 1.5 million euros, which I believe equates to over 1.2 million pounds. So somewhere between 1.2 and 1.3 million pounds. And um, yeah, that is it. So Kettlewell says, quote, I want him at the football club. But if people are offering big numbers for the likes of Theo, then we are a selling club. We want the best players here and to be as strong as we can be. But when fees are being thrown out there, then Mullerwell has to sit up and listen. End of quote. And unfortunately for Mullerwell, the steel men, in this case, they're not made of steel. They're folded. They've had to listen to this ox air bid and they've had to take it. And you know what? I mean, they have to. You can't criticise Mullerwell here. Theo Bear. One year left on his contract. They signed them for free. You know, it was a free transfer. They got him for nothing. And now they're selling him for over £1.2 million. Pounds. That, that is pure profit. If they don't sell him, there's no guarantee he will repeat the success that he did last season. Even if he does, 15 goals would be great. But then you're going to lose him at the end of this season for nothing. So, Mullerwell have to take the money. They have to take the £1.2 million. Pounds, and they need to hope that they can replace Phil Bear with someone else who can come in and score them goals. But uh, you, you can't complain about this from a Mullerwell standpoint. Last season, he came in, and Mullerwell were unlucky last season. They had that spell where they just could not win a game. I think they went 15 games with only two draws and 14 defeats. But without that run of form, they'd have been competing for that top six. There's no doubt about it. They'd have been in the European places, I believe. But... It is what it is. They weren't. They aren't. They stayed up. Field Bear scored a lot of goals and now he has earned himself a move to Auxerre. So good luck to Field Bear. Well done for Mullerwell for getting £1.2 million off a free transfer from a guy that scored one goal and 34 appearances for St Johnston. You can't complain with that. That is a great bit of business. Anyway guys, let's know your thoughts on Field Bear. Is he good enough to stay in the league? Could he have been signed by an old firm club perhaps or... Is he better off leaving and, and going to Ligue 1? Do you think he'll be have success in a foreign league? Let us know down below. And I'll catch you in the next one. Till then, peace.